What is up, YouTube? It's Tita the Two Cam Sam. We are finally back with another video. This video right here today, by the title, as you can see, we are going to do an unboxing and a review of the T8 Garmont Bifta shoe. Right here. I'm about to lower the camera so you all can see this unboxing. One major thing that I did notice as soon as I got the box, y'all, these are my fingertips right here. This is three fingers holding the box. So it's really lightweight, but let's get into it. I ordered these specifically off of Amazon. I was really torn in between the two, between Nike and Garmont. I looked at some reviews and these were my choice. Now these were, were more expensive than the Nike boots. These ones I paid about 174. The Nike ones, on the other hand, if you go to an outlet, the outlet did not have my size. They had them on sale. The Gen 2s, the newest Nike boot, for about 110, 115. So like I said, I got these right here for 170 off of Amazon. Got the Garmont. T8 Bifida, regular. T8 Bifida. Some people like Bifida, B Bifida. We gonna say Bifida. Stay wild. All right, let's get straight into the unboxing. All right, we got the box. First time opening them. On reviews, I did not see this, so I am gonna show this to you guys. So it says, how to take care of your Garmont boots. Get all that those details there for you guys. So you get a little agreement in here. Warranty. Definitely might need that. All right, let's put this back down a little bit more. Now these are nice. You know, it's not like super heavy, but it's not super lightweight. And when I mean by that, I mean, it's not like those other boots that you can take and, you know, scrunch up because, oh, I did not know that these are steel, so that's, that is definitely a plus. So it is not super bulky and heavy. I'm really like the tread on the bottom. Get a look into that. I really like the tread on the bottom. It's really rubbery, a rubbery, a rubbery. So take a look. You can you can see that it's like glued together. So it's not sewed on like some other boots. You all can see the rubber in the back. It's more than in the front. So you're gonna have some good heel protection here. So why I chose this boot instead of the Nike boots, people in my unit have the Nike boots and we go on rucks. We did just did a five and a half, then an eight and a half mile ruck. Uh, tomorrow, this weekend, we are actually supposed to do a 10 mile ruck. This is the left shoe. So one thing about this shoe, it's great for rucking. You're not going to get blisters. Oh my goodness, I have a horrible blister. I'm not even going to tell you guys from my regular army issue joints, you know? My regular army issue shoes. Two sights on the side. You can breathe in them. So I am going to do it on the, on, on the foot review for you all. So water can come out, sweat can come out. You know, get it nice and breathable. These are the Coyote Browns. I like them so far. Obviously it comes with an, a warranty, you know? The bait, but the, the box is really lightweight, so I'm liking these guys, and I cannot wait to try these on for you all. So I hope you all like this unboxing. Give it a thumbs up. If you want to see how to take care of your Garmont boots, here it is. Screenshot this video. I'm going to hold it here for you all. All right, guys. Give this video a thumbs up. Like. There you go, subscribe. More videos on the way. 
I'm just really loving this boot right now, you know? It looks like I am gonna get all around protection, more protection from my heel. I just messed up my Achilles a little bit, some tendonitis there from the ruck. But uh, this boot looks like it might do the job. From other reviews that I have watched, make sure you know, tuck the tongue in long so that these little eye holes won't rub against your skin. So make sure you tuck it. It's a long tongue, it's, it's wide, so. That's a head up, heads up right there. Once I go on my ruck, if I go on the ruck, I'm gonna tell you guys, but these are probably the first boot that I, no, this is the first boot that I actually bought since the Army issue one. Get a good look at them. Pretty lightweight. All right, you guys, so I just took the tissue out the shoe. I haven't seen anybody do this on any of their shoe reviews, so I'm going to, you know, get into detail of the inside of it. Just look inside there. I touched the inside of the sole. It's very nice and soft. You see what it says in there. You know, the Ortholite, Ultralite Garmont. So it looks like, and it seems like, the shoe is gonna be really comfy on the foot. I'm gonna try them on for you all. Oh, okay. So I wear a size eight, an eight in men. And if I was thinking about getting an eight and a half because I saw that, the, that people were saying, oh, get a size up. And I'm not gonna lie, the eight and a half was cheaper on Amazon. But right now I have some room in the back and you know, it, it's nice, it fits. So if you all are thinking about getting this Garmont boot right here, you know, I'm not gonna say don't get it, but I, I, I'm, it's comfortable right now. Y'all are gonna see me wear it uh, tomorrow when I try it on, it's gonna be in the same video, but it's comfy. You can wear the wool sock, you can wear a cotton sock, you know, but it does run true to size. Give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you all later. want to learn how to blouse your boots go check out my video it's a perfect video everybody likes it give it a thumbs up it's about at 800 likes right now and i want to say like 87,000 views so i try to give you guys good content that would help you i love helping you all go ahead check it out i'll see you guys later